In the land of Mordor, in the fires of Mount Doom, the Dark Lord Sauron forged in secret a master ring. And into this ring he poured his cruelty, his malice, and his will to dominate all life. One by one, the free lands of Middle-earth fell to the power of the ring. But there were some who resisted. The last alliance of men and elves marched against the armies of Mordor, and on the slopes of Mount Doom they fought for the freedom of Middle-earth. Victory was near. But the power of the ring could not be undone. It was in this moment when all hope had faded that Isildur, son of the king, took up his father's sword. The one ring was lost for thousands of years. Now, destiny has placed the ring in the care of an unlikely creature, a hobbit, Frodo Baggins. Along with the help of his friends, Frodo set forth on a perilous journey to the land of Mordor to destroy the ring in the fires of Mount Doom. But the Dark Lord Sauron has again emerged. And with vengeance, he commands an army bred but for one purpose, to destroy the free peoples of Middle-earth. Sauron now desperately searches for that which was his in ages past. Should Sauron find the One Ring, darkness shall once again fall upon Middle-earth. That's a pretty cool intro, but anyhow, uh, got another old school game here, and uh, this one, I'm afraid to say I haven't really played it. I got it on a compilation of games in EA Strategy Collection. It's got a Command and Conquer, Generals with an expansion pack, and Black and White 2 with an expansion, plus Battle for Middle Earth. I actually bought the compilation largely for the Command and Conquer game, so I haven't really played this one, and I have absolutely no earthly idea what the hell I'm doing, so victory is not guaranteed. I will probably fail miserably, but that is fine. I'm not here to claim to be an expert on this shit, because I'm not. So, anyhow, let's see. Uh, since I have no idea what the hell I'm doing, I'm actually going to change the vol the sound settings somewhat. Uh, Got to make sure you can actually hear me. Voice. I am a servant that. of the secret fire. Ambient. Well, we'll keep the ambient volume. Movie. Well, we can leave the cinematics. But need some sound because I'm not going to be uh, talking during cinematics anyway. I am a servant of the secret fire. Okay, that should work. Um, resolution, I'm not going to mess with that. I'll just accept the changes, that should work. Now, since I've got no idea what I'm doing, I'm going to go to the battle school and hopefully learn what the hell I'm doing. Uh... Okay. World map. Welcome to the Battle for Middle Earth tutorial. Here you will learn the basics of how to lead your forces into war. In the Battle for Middle Earth, it is your goal to defeat the forces of the enemy, capture their lands, and destroy their castles. You will command the armies of good and evil, conquer the lands of your enemy, and seal the fate of the One Ring. There are two main portions of the game, the living world 
and battle mode. The Living World map will allow you to survey all of Middle-earth, and it is from here that you will make high-level strategic choices. You may left-click to zoom in. When zoomed in, you can decide which territory to conquer in order to collect bonuses for your army. To scroll through the map, push your cursor toward the edge of the screen to move in that direction. When choosing which territory to attack, left-click to select an active army. Then right-click on an enemy region to send your selected army to that location. When you attack an enemy region, you must fight that battle before continuing on. Active battles will be noted by blue arrows pointing to a gold battle marker. Left-click the battle marker to enter battle mode. Okay. Uh, I expected to actually have to do something, but oh well. Moves and attacks. Let's see. The most critical portion of the game is battle mode. In battle mode, you will be tasked with creating castles or camps, collecting resources, and building an army in order to destroy your enemies. Your forces will consist of infantry, creatures, heroes, and structures. To scroll through the map, push your cursor toward the edge of the screen to move in that direction. To move your units, left-click on a soldier to select him. Keep on your guard. Soldiers move in battalions. Selecting a single soldier will select the entire battalion. Right-click on open ground Take this area. to move your battalion to that location. Left-click on open ground to deselect your units. Deselecting your units will help you avoid issuing unintended orders. Notice that your selection icon changes to an attack cursor when you have units selected and move your mouse over an enemy. To attack, select a unit and right-click on the enemy. Attack! Our forces are under attack! To attack enemy structures, select a unit Maintain and right-click on the building. Take their buildings down! Attacking walls and gates works the same way. The only siege weapons like trebuchets may attack walls. Okay, um, since I'm not going to actually do anything on the tutorial, I'm just going to exit that and we'll figure it out as we go. I'm probably going to... Well, let's see, so what? Uh, we'll start a campaign. So it would be good or evil. Mm -hmm. Well, let's be the good guys. And then... We'll put it on medium difficulty. I don't want it to be too easy. I don't want it too hard, so... Begin. Mordor is the land of the Dark Lord Sauron. He has dominion over this bleak and wasted landscape and all who enter it. Sauron wages war with all of Middle Earth. He must be stopped, or all shall fall into darkness. The hobbit Frodo Baggins now bears the ring, guarded by a fellowship drawn from all the free peoples of Middle-earth. The One Ring must be returned to Mount Doom and destroyed in the very fires of its creation. Okay, uh, it's Rivendell. This is the fellowship, and I have to go to Moria. Why can't I go somewhere different? What is that the Shire? That's Bree. Where's the Shire? That? 
I'm actually confused as to why I don't start out in the Shire. I'm over by Rivendell. But anyway, I guess I'm going to Moria with the Fellowship. Okay, well, here it goes. See what happens. The mines of Moria, once proud city of the dwarves, its ruined halls are now infested with vile goblins. I know I don't know what to expect. This is all uh, new to me. Even though it's an old game, I just haven't played it. Uh, yeah, whenever it loads up. This might be my, my old computer struggling, I don't know. One choice. You must face the darkness of Moria. Okay. Well, I guess these are my Gandalf, Aragorn, the Golas, Gimli, Boromir, Frodo, Sam, Merry, and Pippin. Okay. All these guys. Powers menu, what's this? Heal. Help and get 50% damage. Heals units. That might be a good idea to have that. Uh, although Elven gifts is. Heal. I'm gonna take that for right now. Uh, I can see that would come in handy to be able to heal things. Although I don't know how to heal. Is that it? Is that Aragorn? That has... Okay. Wizard Blast. What's his uh, special? Hawk Strike. Shortcut. T... His axe throat. Well, mm, this looks like it might be complicated. What's that? Heal. Okay, that's on a timer, I guess. All right. Well, I'm gonna press on. We should never have come here. We should never have come here. Let us hope that our presence may go unnoticed. Goblin. Well, evidently it didn't. I think Frodo just got hit. What's this? Veterancy upgrade. Who's going to get it? Mary. Just okay. What what does Mary have now? Go rock. Uh. Sword. Go rock. Objectives. Head fellowship, 
through the halls of Mariano, the fellowship members survive, destroy the Balrog. I had five treasures, rank all heroes to level two. Purchase, but well, I purchased a power. Uh, Mary leveled to number two. Um, oh, get everybody, please. Thank you. I don't know how much what it'll take to get everybody to level two. Charge. Is it not? Five treasures. Quiet. Goblins are close. Goblins. Well, I don't see no goblins. I hear them. There they are. Well, apparently that was pretty straightforward and easy. Who's that? The goal is at the back. Figures. Any treasures? I don't see any. There's more goblins. There's a treasure. Oh, that's a veterancy upgrade. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get, uh... Aragorn and... Thoromir? Fuck! We got a bit of a situation. Get what's a wizard blast? Too late. Well, I'm gonna have, uh. Let's get Gandalf to get a veterancy upgrade. Lightning sword. So I have two heroes ranked up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven more to go. I probably ought to focus more on the hobbits than anybody else. There is evil here that does not sleep. Evil that does not sleep. What do we have here? Humans. More goblins. I've never seen a creature like that. Aragorn ready to heal people just in case. And so far, so good. Aragorn, get a bit of healage. One of the hobbits was hurt. Legolas didn't get selected in group one. Okay. Hmm, there's two directions I can go. I don't know which way to go. Well, we'll try upstairs first, or up here first.